Susie Wilkes, welcome to a brand new series of Changing Rooms. Now, just in case you've forgotten what this show is all about, I thought I'd take a moment to refresh your memory. Friends, neighbours or even relatives swap houses to redesign a room at each other's place. They get a limited amount of time to complete the job and have to stick to a tight budget. Now you know the basics, let's meet tonight's teams. Deborah Gill and her husband Brett both work as factory managers. They're expecting their first child. Donna Mangay is a print production manager. Her partner, David Delbo, is an oil refinery operator. Brett and David have been mates for years. Their partners have also become good friends. And now both couples holiday together. Remember, each team gets two days and $1,200 to complete the makeover. And they can't come home until all the hard work is done. As always, we'll be watching the teams every step of the way and I'll be keeping my own video camera handy to capture any behind-the-scenes action. Helping the teams out tonight will be designers Deborah de Jong, Tim Janenko paneev and, of course, our resident handyman, James Lunday. Donna and David are keen to liven up their party room. Now what we love about the room is the floor and the bar. It's really good for entertaining for parties. Yeah, and I also like the bookshelf. We'd like to see something that would match in with my swords and my medieval books and stuff. We'd like to see, I you'd would, like to I see something like that. that. <laughs> yeah, but I don't care. The rest of the house is mine, this is his, so he can do that. He can have one room. Deborah and Brett want to transform a spare bedroom. We'd like it to be a formal dining room rather than, because at the moment our dining room's in the middle of our lounge room, which is pretty at the front door. Because the kitchen's just there, so it'd be good to <laughs> knock that wall out or something, do like something silly like that. Yeah, and, and enclose that, so maybe so. <laughs> or even leave that door there, so because the bathroom's just up there, so... Yeah, I'd so. like to see light colours, but more traditional, more old-fashioned looking, rather than bright and contemporary. And I'd love to have something like, um, down the end, like a feature sort of thing, like a um, fireplace or something like that, just to make it like a real old-fashioned sort of feature, rather than having something that's just like a table slapped in the middle of a room, so... OK, guys, it's time to head off for a little redecorating at your mate's place. So you better swap keys and get going. Okay, okay, see you. Bye. Bye. Okay, we have a very, very tiny bedroom here. What are we going to do with it? Uh, convert it to a formal dining room. A formal dining yes, room. Yes, right. Yeah. So what do you imagine formal dining room to be? Chandeliers, lights, yeah. nice table. Very old-fashioned, sort yeah. of. Old-fashioned. Yes. Antiques, cutlery, maybe. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So were you talking like Victorian or sort of yeah. Baroque kind of thing? Are we, yeah. Uh... yeah, pretty much the uh, Georgian sort of style. Okay, yeah. all yeah. right, all right. Now, okay. have we talked colour? What sort of colour have you got in mind? Oh, I think a deep colour, yeah. uh, like burgundy, maroon, or... Sort of dark green, sort of maybe. Green? Yeah. Green or maroon? Both, 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 maybe. Both, definitely yeah. both. Half, yeah. half, no, all right. whatever. All right. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. Now, uh, what about this floor? We've got a sort of a pale blue carpet here. Are we mm. going to keep no, that? No, no, we'll no, we'll pull it up. Yeah, I'd like to do that. Yeah, get rid of it. Yeah, it's a bit ugly, don't Okay, have you guys checked underneath? No. So you don't know what's there? No. It'll be interesting to see what we're going to expect. Let's get cracking. Great. Whose room is it? It's, it's Dave's room. Okay, oh, yes. definitely Dave's. Because uh, Donna has redone the whole house, and this is the only room that hasn't been touched. Okay. And he's into castles and swords, swords. and things like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, loves them. So loves them. And medieval, them. medieval type medieval. fell and dragons. Right. And right. Tell me what you'd like to see in here. Um, I'd like to change the bar, or just make it so it's a feature, because there's not much furniture or anything in here, so no. just make it a bit different. I think we sort of... Can see yeah, that. So yeah. we need to revamp the bar. Yep. yep something right. Make it more of a feature. Yep. For sure, for sure. Right. Yeah. Fantastic. And now the walls. What do you think about those? Get rid of them. Yeah. <laughs> no, <laughs> <don't> <laughs> <want> them. <laughs> okay. We need yeah, to disguise or revamp. Up somehow. Yeah. Sure. Now the floor's going to stay. We're going to yeah. keep the yeah, timber. Yeah. Yeah. Don't right. want to touch that. Okay. Can well, we please do something with these doors. Um. Yeah. <laughs> I was, was going to suggest that. Yeah. Okay.
there's oh, concrete. The concrete under here. Oh, no. <laughs> you know, you've got the stripes, and you said you want to get rid of the stripes. Well, I kind of like the stripes. So rather than get rid of them, we're going to enhance them. So how about a tin each? Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, actually, I yeah, like those colours. Like, they're quite they're nice. nice. Yeah. Okay, no, not nice. too bright. I don't like no. the stripe idea, but. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, it's half concrete, half floorboards. God, this is just getting more interesting as we go. And these floorboards are quite nice, too. Yeah, they are. How did Rod, that happen? Rod goes here. <laughs> this is going to be a little bit more difficult. Definitely. Yeah. We're going to use those two together, and then we're going to use this at picture rail height. Let's oh, nice. wow. get our fleur de lis yeah. medieval theme. Yeah, I like that. What do you think? Looks good. It's great. Yeah, I like really that. Really nice. I like, that. I like it. Well, hang on. what's the consensus? Do we want to keep this carpet or not? Like, the carpet's not going to work. So, should we work with this, yeah. or should we work with the carpet? Work with this. All right. That, that's a consensus, Dave. Yeah, all right. Happy to go? Yeah. All right, well, let's rip the rest up and see what the rest of this thing looks like. I know, it's not workable. Oh. Can't do this. <laughs> What's happened? I know, I oh, see you do that. Have it, have you? <laughs> Stay there, Brett. That's lovely. Oh. It's all part of the design. It is. Oh, it sure. Seatbacks in the upright position. If you don't like the sound coming from your neighbour next door. Hand luggage stowed in front. The bigger the bag, the better. Stay seated. There's room on the wing, there's room in the loop. Airport returns with all new episodes 9.10 tonight on 9. With today's shock news that 80% of all flight paths have been redirected over this single suburb, residents are up in arms at the level of aircraft noise. Looking for a new house? Find something better in the new look domain. Now out on Thursdays and Saturdays. Right now, every time you buy any two specially marked Cadbury bars, you'll get a third specially marked bar free. So it's one, two, three. Hello, I'm Amanda Keller. And I'm Andrew Denton. We do the breakfast show on Triple M. It's great. Don't believe us? You'll believe this man. My very good friends at the Andrew Denton Breakfast Show do the funniest show. You want me to say ever? Yes. Well, let's just back it up a minute. I mean it. Back it up. All right. It's the funniest show ever. Lovely. The opinions broadcast in this commercial were not necessarily those of John Laws. The thing you already knew that, didn't you? Triple M's Andrew Denton Breakfast Show. It's funny. Know what I mean? new noodle sauces, you can create a whole range of delicious noodle meals. How do you think I'd look with a beer? Mm, different. It's hot noodles, Mum. You and Continental, just brilliant. You, you cleaned, cleaned the bathroom, bathroom, didn't you? you? Still ten minutes before inspection. <laughs> Introducing <laughs> Duck for Bathrooms. It easily removes soap scum without scrubbing. Germs wash away too, leaving a pleasant citrus fragrance. I'm going to buy it. It's a great house. No, this. Your bathroom looks fantastic. New duck for bathrooms. Tough on bathrooms, easy on you. At Minor 10's huge Sticker to Me sale, you choose your own discount. Just tear off a discount voucher from this flyer for any item in the store and we'll deduct the discount from the normal price. Save up to 30%. Thursday only, February 10 at Minor 10. When it's time to clean your outside windows, does the job seem this big? Next time, try new Windex Outdoor. Its concentrated formula dissolves grime to get windows clean. New Windex Outdoor. A Windex shine in a lot less time. It's back. This is going to be insane. Bigger. You can only crack one fat. Hey. Stronger. Oh, I'm terrified at the moment. <laughs> Excellent. And a lot more frightening. You're ridiculous as far as I'm concerned. The Footy Show, 9.30 Thursday on 9. Now, I think we need an opening in this wall. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that uh, my Deborah is pregnant, Deb? Is she? She sure is. Oh, OK, well, we need to get her out of the room. I've already, I've already gone on to that. Oh, okay, She's out. Good. Lady with the baby, gone. Before we get too excited, the issue is what's on the other side of the wall. We've got a cupboard that's going to have to come down. Yep. OK, we've got another unit 
It's going to have to come out. Mm -hmm. We've got tiles, which are going to have to come off the wall. Yeah. Well, do these guys want to renovate this kitchen eventually? Well, they're yeah. going to have to yeah. if we do this. Yeah. Because we don't have the time or the budget to reinstate this side of the room. It's going to look a mess. The other Deb yeah. is a little bit concerned about the stripes. Are you, con are you concerned about her concerns? <laughs> Uh, I think she should concentrate on her pregnancy at this point in time <laughs> and not be concerned about the stress. She's not backward and coming forward with this one, I tell you. <laughs> we, we need to make a decision. You can, you can, you know, you can wrap it up as much as you want. Yeah. You can, you I'm know. I'm just giving them the other side, Jane. It's going to look a it. mess, okay? No, I think we do it. We still do it? Yeah. All right? Yeah, yeah, we'll do it. Okay, let's get into it. Next one. Let's go. What do you reckon? Dinner. <laughs> wow. Oh, Deb, go for it. Now don't hold back. Beautiful. Excellent. Having a bit of a read? Is that is that well, book is that book called How to Chip Off Tiles in Three Easy Steps? Someone's gotta tell you what to do. I'm, right. I'm the only well, let's male just have here. Have a look at what it's called. Oh, oh right. Sure. Doesn't look like a home renovating guide to me. He annoys me when I work with him, but... Tell me why. <laughs> I don't know, because he's lazy. <laughs> ah, why do you think he's lazy? He just sits there and watches, because <laughs> he doesn't have any ideas, so he just sits there and waits for you to tell him what to do. So this is the chandelier? Yes. The Yellows search Deb and Brett's garage for anything they can use. What do you think? Not to my taste, but I'm pretty sure they'll like it. God, I think it's bloody hideous. <laughs> Watch out, she's going to... <laughs> The delight in discovering a nice table is cut short. <laughs> I wouldn't start. I actually think I can see him. Oh, my God! Hello. Jace, what are you doing? I'm putting a doorway in. Yeah, but it looks like you're destroying the house in the process. Waistcoat's dry. We need to get our paint. It's really, really runny. And we apply it in what's called a cross-hatched method, which is just literally... da 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 So little X's everywhere, yep. OK? And that's what one person does. And the second person gets their muslin. OK, and dabs. <laughs> Dave, while you were working with James up here, Donna and I made a decision on the floor colour. Okay. And what was that colour? Deep red. So this is what it looks like. It's all right. Now, time for the walls. You asked for? Green. What do you think I'm going to give you? <laughs> I don't know. Green. Oh, cool. oh beautiful. Yeah, love it. That's cool. I'll get this crisscross method. I'll tell you, I haven't got time for crisscross method. I've got to get it done. I don't want to be doing this at 10 o'clock at night, I can tell you that. Tim prepares new backs for the dining room chairs. All right. So, it will end up looking something like that. Yep, beautiful. While Deborah makes a start oh, on the Great yeah, Wall of Duyong. Susie, you do the front. Right, got it. Believe it or not, but Tim is starting to make a couple of unusual great. brackets. This feels good, actually. I trust you to enjoy it. You're going to breathe through this apparatus here, OK? Oh. So this is going to go on your head. That's all right, I'm a mouth breather anyway. Hey, and I'm going, that's going to stick through. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no! <laughs> Thank God to see you here, son. Oh. They're giving you a hard time. Well, working with three girls, all I've heard about is kitchen colours and babies. <laughs> oh, I've had a gutful. Tell None me about of which your car. You want to know about. <laughs> tell me about your car or something, for God's sake. Got it setting already. Oh no, quick! We're working with a fast-setting rubber used in dentistry called Alginate to make a mould of David's face. No, it's good. It's happening. It's okay. It's I want enough. you to blow out. Have we got this around the edges your enough? Mouth, you've got to blow out. Okay. okay. Ready? Blow out. That's it. it. Brett? Yep. You've been stuck inside. <laughs> Mate, have I got a treat for you? It's good to get out. Look at this. Look at this. Sweet. Look okay. at that. Oh, beautiful. Let's get into beautiful. it. Beautiful. It's coming off my skin. Not much nicely, longer actually. now. How are you going? Are you okay? Don't try this at home, kids. So Tim is fully seconds. trained at keeping his subjects safe while wow, humiliating them. Tolerant man. You look bloody good, actually. Oh, yeah. All righty. <laughs> Proud to go. Ah. There you go. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> and don't forget to let go of the mouthpiece. <laughs> Hello there! <laughs> That's 
That's actually uh, not bad. Why is it not working now? Here we go. Next step, ooh, add the plaster. Ooh, sloppy. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. Okay, ready? <laughs> Slowly. Wow! Oh my god, look at there that. There you go. There you are. Give her a bit of a stir. Okay, so manufacturer's instructions were that we put it on with a compressor. It's not the result that I wanted, so we're going to have to get messy. You happy to get messy? I'm happy to get messy. Basically, every time they screw a screw in, it, the chair becomes in, unlevel up, again. So it just grabs it and lifts it. Doesn't matter how many times we measure it, whatever, it keeps getting unlevel, which is becoming a real pain. Well, it should be the end of the first day, but I don't think either team will be resting their weary bones until very late tonight. The purple team obviously didn't realise how involved a sandstone painted finish was going to be. And as for the yellow team, well, they wanted to paint the floor, and to do that, it has to be done tonight so it dries in time for tomorrow. I think we might have a few grumpy people with a lack of sleep tomorrow morning. What? No, that looks crap. I don't like it at all. I no, don't that looks that really looks bad. Terrible. No, don't, don't do that side. Just do that. Oh, you're a plastic. Go away, you're annoying me. We've got issues here. We've run out of time, we've run out of budget, and uh, I think we've got to live with it. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay? Yep. This sucks. This is just terrible oh, stuff, this is. The we're... design is not very happy. So we're just sticking it on with our hands because we're trying to get it all done so that we can go to bed. We're not allowed to go to bed or eat until we finish it. So. Until this wall's done. Monday, I got Friday on my mind. The party's back. The first Friday night football of the year. Parramatta take on Brisbane. Friday night football. Friday, 8.30, only on 9. Know how to use a spray gun? Make sure the nozzle isn't blocked. Get the know-how at home. You could win a fabulous Tuscan holiday for four simply by sending in any two barcodes from the Latina Fresh range. Make room for another four. <laughs> Imagine your own table in Tuscany. on P&O's Fair Princess. Now you can cruise from only $899. There's simply no better value holiday for $899. So get up and go. go Book your 2000 cruise now. Go the Nissan Challenge is on again. We challenge you to find a car with more features than a Pulsar Plus for just $19,990. We challenge you to find one with air conditioning, CD, airbag, remote central locking, alloy wheels, plus a rear spoiler. And we challenge you to get it for just $19,990. The Nissan Challenge. Take it up at your Nissan dealer. If you'd like to participate in all the fun of changing rooms... Yes! Yes! Oh, 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 oh my God, it's such a difference! Then give us a call during office hours on 9437 1613. Pantene Ultra V Shampoo and Conditioner can make a powerful difference in your hair. It'll give you up to 95% less breakage, more strength, more hair. Pantene, love your hair. No way to check for a gas bottle leak. Never use a naked flame. Get the know-how at home. Well, first thing in the morning, and I bet these guys wish they were still in bed. I worked so late last night. I hate this part because it gets really scary. Sometimes their moods are just... 
so we'll see. Brett. Morning. How's the blood pressure this morning? Oh, oh you're just <laughs> shaky. Oh, good, oh, you're smiling. I didn't want grumpy pants. <laughs> So it needs screws in here. Like we just had nightmare doing it last night. Like it was when we actually screwed it all together, it ended up being so oh, an absolute pain in the ass. It was like wobbling like that. Okay, well let's put one of these together properly and then we'll let's check it out. Yeah, okay. we'll reassess it, alright? Last night was very tense with the chairs and it was late and everyone had had enough basically. So we just thought we'd just leave the chairs till the morning rather than having a full on. <laughs> All in brawls. <laughs> yeah. What are you making here? You've drawn a line. Um, yeah, I'm making windows for the doors. Where James is going to cut holes in the doors. And what I'm doing is you go, it's like lead lighting. So you just basically paint in the different colours and then um, you outline it with the black. And it's supposed to look like lead light. Supposed to. Supposed to. Are you a good drawer? No. <laughs> That's one. Brett follows yet another of Deborah's commandments and carves out a pew. Uh, as you will notice that I'm way offline and, and I think I will need divine intervention to try and get this right. Tim performs a quick facial on his corbel style brackets. At the end of this program, you'll see everyone going, oh, look at the room. <laughs> so it has to be finished tonight. <laughs> but you know that if things don't get finished, we leave them. If the room, leave it so out of the for room. instance, if the room was like it is now, yeah. and um, it was the end of the day, yeah. the room gets left like that. Because that's oh, the really? rules, two days and $1,200. Oh. I reckon that's it. Yeah. Here we go. It's really good. What do you think? Really good. And what are you doing? Well, these are really bland. But we've run out of money, so we need to do something. So I've just cut a fleur-de-lis and spray-painted it. And I think we might just fix it up a little bit and put the lion's head back on here, and it just jazzes up the door a bit. What do you think? Mm. <laughs> Squeeze in. Now, what do you think of this? I got James to put some architrave around the door. Very nice. Stylish? Yes, definitely. What you wanted? Classy. I've just got a wet rag with a bit of black... Deborah is still not happy with that wall. Texture, what do you think about something like that? Yeah. Does that look a bit more realistic? Yeah. No, it yeah. looks good. It's just a bit too matte. Maybe if you put it a bit on the bricks as well. Yeah. That's a good like idea. Make it look aged. No. I think they look fine. Yeah. Same height, they're perfect. Like, yeah. They're they identical. Look... And they're of the era from the room that oh, you're trying to not. match. They are. They're not. They're, um, copper art, 1985. Surprisingly, that chandelier has made it upstairs. So I want this to sit over the square table, but I want it to hang reasonably low, but not, not so it's like in front of their faces when they're eating, but just above head height. The reason for this is you put the red coat on first, then the blue coat, and then sand the blue off so you can see parts of the red. Where if you really ask me, I would have brushed it on lightly so that way, I don't have to put another full coat on. That's about the That's height. probably perfect. That's it. Yeah. Nicely just above head height. Yeah, just do that. Okay, well we've made the we've made the design bigger. I think I should How just come? stay here. Well ask Deb. Deb and Deb. But I thought you were in charge. No, I'm just the worker here. Well, it's Tim's idea, and it goes at the end. Donna wants to dress up this ceiling rose before Tim hangs it. Where else? On the wall. And so I've asked to put some gold on it. Changing these bright ones right down to this, like a bit softer. See what I've done? I've just put a bit of this French wash on it. Yeah, no, it looks heaps better. Is it better? Yeah. Okay. Whatever you want gold, we paint with this German size. Okay. Which is what the gold leafing actually sticks to. Right. So yeah, we have to do is paint this on, let it dry until it's tacky. Uh -huh. Won't take too long. Then put the gold leafing on top. Okay. Okay. Great. Isn't this fantastic? Yes, it looks great. How good is it? And it's so cheap to do this yeah. and easy. Mm. And 
towards you a bit, just a wow. slice. Yeah, that looks unreal. Oh, no. Yeah, it looks really good. Okay, so we're going to line this up? No, that's it. Time's up. You're joking. No. So we're not going to put one in this nope. cupboard? We haven't got time. Get up. We'll be back soon. Well done. Yay! Fantastic. <laughs> On a current affair, kids' clothing that busts the budget. Just overpriced. Our special tests to find real value. They'll get suckered into just the very top premium brands. Better buys that last longer. Probably a third of the price. Tomorrow, 6.30. In the wrong job? With the biggest choice, you'll always find something better in Herald Classifieds. Sal? Yeah? The exchange student Michelle's arrived. Does she have to share my room? We were wrong. She's a he. New McFlurry from McDonald's for a cool spin on your afternoon. For the one special Valentine in your life, why not come and see a truly stunning range of beautiful jewellery gifts? Most cash converters pieces have been independently valued, certified and then discounted simply because they're no longer new. All are beautifully presented and before your heart decides, ask to see the independent valuation certificate for your financial peace of mind. This range, this value is as close as the jewellery section of your nearest cash converter store. When I used to wash my husband's work overalls, there was always this chemical smell on them, all the time, for years. He started to lose weight. He coughed up blood. He didn't have the right safety gear on. He didn't know. Now he's gone. There was a big investigation. Get serious about work safety. For information, call work cover. It's hard at Christmas. <laughs> and on the kids' birthdays. It's very hard. Mmm, Mortine Lauren Kill Surface Spray. Duh! Uh oh. Harry! <laughs> There's nothing attractive about that Lure and Kill. Mortine Lure and Kill lures and kills cockroaches for up to six months. Mortine. Right now, every time you buy any two specially marked Cadbury bars, you'll get a third specially marked bar free. So it's one, two, three. At Minor 10's huge Sticker to Me sale, you choose your own discount. Just tear off a discount voucher from this flyer for any item in the store and we'll deduct the discount from the normal price. Save up to 30%. Thursday only, February 10 at Minor 10. Seat backs in the upright position. If you don't like the sound coming from your neighbour next door. And remain in your seat. There's room on the wing. Airport returns next on nine. you Tim but I feel a little underdressed in here now. I think that makes both of us. I think you need to be in a formal dress and I need to be in black tie to fit in here. How did you make such a big change though? How do you create this formal feel? Would you would you believe that there's one simple ingredient and that is symmetry. What's on one side of the room is mirrored on the other and that's it. I can't believe the yellow team knocked a hole in their friend's wall. I know that was rather courageous of them wasn't it? But it had to be done. Without it it wouldn't have been as effective and it looks great looking into the room from there now too. What was the most expensive thing in here? The most expensive thing was the, the dining setting that includes the chairs that you see around us. And the cheapest? The cheapest item, well, we were lucky. We had lots of furniture that was sort of within the house to work with, but the core balls were the cheapest things that we made. And they were fun. They were great. Now, you had a few problems with the floor. Well, we had problems, and the problem was, probably the largest one was the floor. Yes, the floorboards and the fact that there was concrete in the one room was a bit of a surprise. That was bad luck. It was bad luck. And the best thing we could do was paint it. 
and unfortunately that's tipped us over on the budget. So you're over budget? We are, just. On the count of three, guys. One, two, three. <gasps> wow. Oh, wow. Excellent. It does look old fashioned. Very and nice. The light. Very nice. Oh. Is that, that's our chandelier, that's, isn't it? That's a five dollar auction chandelier. <laughs> Oh, Very yeah. nice. And what's that? Excellent. A wheel. <laughs> that, that is like a ceiling rose, which is oh, excellent. Wow. Look at these chairs. Oh, and there's a door. That's right. I was oh, waiting for you to notice that. Yeah. I love this colour. I said we said we didn't want dark room, yeah. but no, we love no, it. No, no, I love it. Look at the floor. Wow. What do you think oh, of the floor? Unreal. Unreal. What do you think of it? They've done a lot of work, haven't they? A, do you know a the lot of work. Truth, I don't like the floor. Don't like the floor. That face, right. have a good look at those faces on the wall. Do you recognise that David person? Dunners. At Dave's. That's both Dave's. Dave's? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. He's going to be watching you eat dinner every night <laughs> of your lives. Oh, how haunting. <laughs> <laughs> Can you no, eat no, dinner here nice. every night? Yeah. Yeah, no, no that'd be very nice. Will very you nice. cook for your Gorgeous. lovely wife every night? Uh, yes, I'll, I'll whip her up some two minute noodles. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> delicious. <laughs> Debbie, are you happy with the result? Yeah, I'm, I'm fairly happy with the result. We did run out of time. It took a long time to do the wall, so we missed out on getting the other stained glass window in, which was a pity. However, I'm not that thrilled with the one that is in, so perhaps we can cover that up instead. <laughs> Blessing in disguise. <laughs> Absolutely. What do you like the most? I think my most favourite and the cheapest would be the bar. We flipped the tiles, which was a lot of fun, mm -hmm. and we revealed a nice piece of Oregon and stained it up with a bit of boot polish and wax, and I really like it. It's come up really nice. Was that the cheapest thing as well? Yeah, it was. It was. So I was quite pleased. And what about the most expensive? Most expensive and time consuming was the wall behind us. We, we thought we'd have a go with the product and make this sandstone wall. And it took a long time to do, long time to dry, long time to put up, and it was expensive. But I kind of like it. I hope they do too. I'm glad you do after all those Yeah, things. absolutely. Now, did you meet your budget? Yeah, we did, which was a surprise. I thought we'd definitely be over, but we managed to just squeeze in there. So I'm really pleased. Two, three, open. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, medieval, here we go. <laughs> you said it. Oh, wow. Are you oh. OK? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Donna? Oh, 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 yeah, it's cool. Stone glass, isn't that great? Look, that's really cool. Got they should try again, they should try again. They're my dragon, yeah. Oh, I've got a post on the wall. <laughs> what do you that think cool? of that wall? I love it. That wall is great. Bad, yes. That's fantastic, yeah. Yes, very good. I love it, yeah. What about the stripes on the other walls? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? Um, they're okay, I guess okay. you had to have them. Especially with the thing, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it matches. Look, yeah. look, look at your bar. Contrast. The bar's on now. Oh, I love it. Look at that bar. That Isn't that fantastic? It's just great. Oh, that's great. And these doors are wonderful. <laughs> oh, this is excellent. <laughs> what do you think that's of great. the pew? Good. Well, here they are. <laughs> 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 what do you think? Oh, this is great. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I suppose you guys have to put up with the stripes and you guys have to put up with the floor. <laughs> <laughs> so it's all worked out pretty well. It's all worked out pretty well, I think. Anyhow, that's it tonight for Changing Rooms, so we'll see you next week. Bye-bye. For more information on tonight's show, phone 1902 246 547. If you prefer to have it faxed, call us on 1902 246 546. Tomorrow on the Carnival Affair, children's clothing that breaks the family budget and the results of our special consumer tests to find real value that lasts the distance. Advice to save you time and money, tomorrow at 6.30. Check in now for our new series of Airport.